My name is Pamela Nakamba Kabaso. I work for a think tank in Zambia called the Zambia Institute for Policy Analysis and Research. It's a semi-autonomous think tank which works very closely with uh, the government, in particularly the Ministry of National Development Planning. In Zambia, we do not have so many think tanks. Actually, ZIPA is one of the first think tank established of its kind. Of course, there are other smaller ones coming up, and uh, their role really has been to provide um, evidence for policy making, for policy decisions, and of course also to help evaluate and monitor some government policies and programs. Well, first of all, I think for a long time, government in Zambia has been uh, uh, working, implementing policies without so much evidence. So there's been a number of going back and forth, policy reversals when now new information come to light. And this has taken longer sometimes to achieve intended objectives. But with the coming on of think tanks and the strengthening of the think tank community, it has helped to provide evidence when it is needed and therefore able to shape policies in the best way so that it can achieve intended objectives in a shorter time. Of course, one of the biggest challenges think tanks are facing in Zambia is firstly, lack of capacity. There are so many demands which are placed on think tanks in Zambia, especially with the realization in government of the need for informed uh, policies. But we do not yet have so many people uh, with a career in think tanks because most of uh, the academic institutions do not produce uh, readily prepared people. So working in a think tank requires a step further. And this, of course, takes uh, a lot of time to just create the required capacity to effectively uh, do think tank work. And this has uh, tended to, of course, um, uh, pose a challenge in meeting the demands placed on us by various stakeholders such as government. It is very exciting, especially in Zambia now, we have got quite a few think tanks which have come up. And some of them, of course, following in our footsteps, some of them learning from where we, 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 we've already worked. And also in the region, we've had a number of think tanks coming up, like from Malawi. We even had uh, one think tank came to Zambia to just learn from us. So there's this closely knit uh, think tank community in the region and we've been networking, trying to work together and learn from one another.